Hey, you guys, welcome back to the channel. So I'm going to give my opinion on this whole I mean, you doki situation um, and how I feel about the situation. I'm going to run a video as I talk and kind of go over the context of what's going on uh, behind the scenes, because this is just one of the, one of the videos um, that I made. But I do have um, I mean, I, I feel some type of way about it. But of course, you know, what I mean, these are rich people problems, so <laughs> it's just what it is. Um, but make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Make sure you guys um, help us get 1,000 subscribers to the channel before the year is out. We definitely can use your help to help us do that. Um, so the Boston Celtics coach, I mean, Udoki, okay? He's had an affair with a female staff member. Mm -hmm. Yes, him. Mm -hmm. um, so it's been uh, reported by all over social media that Neil, Neil Long, his longtime fiance and girlfriend, she had no idea about the affair. She heard about it just like everybody else, which is very sad. Um, and this sucks. It really does. So, you know, we know Neil Long. She's a legendary actor, but she's also a mother to, I mean, Yudoki's 10-year-old son that they share together. Um, like I said, she found out about this affair on social media, just as everyone else. And she has issued a statement, guys. So she is talking publicly about this. But like I said, Nia Long is straight. She don't really need him. But this is what she had to say, okay? Um, she said, the outpouring of love and support from family and friends in a community during this difficult time means so much to me. She said, understatement, I ask that my privacy be respected as I process the recent events above all. I am a mother and will continue to focus on my children. In my opinion, this is the reason, this is the reason why women that are successful sometimes, in some cases, do not like dating pro athletes and pioneers in mentorship, okay? Because they have so many bad stim stigmas attached to them, you know? We see time and time again that they have too much money, too many options, and too many women willing to cross certain lines with them, no matter the outcome. But clearly, this, this guy is dumb, okay? Although I know he's embarrassed, he's still dumb. Why? Because he had to know this would come to surface someday. I mean, he put himself on the line and I don't even know, like, really, was it worth the trouble? I don't understand what goes on in these men's minds. OK, so he's clearly out here sleeping and dating a woman, a staff member who works in his circle as if he wasn't going to get caught. Did he think he actually had an invisible cape on? Like, this is stupid at its finest. I can't make this up. He's definitely going to lose millions of dollars over this guaranteed um but you know i'm sure his career will be fine because he's a coach and he has um taken his team a long way right but where would he be with his family um after this you know his career is in question as well you know following these events that took place he's gonna have some some punishment and he's already been um, receiving punishment swiftly because he's been suspended as the head coach of the Boston Celtics NBA team for an entire year. Okay. That's just for starters. Um, so yeah, you guys let me know what do you think will come out of this? Um, or how can he make it right? You guys let me know in the comment section. Um, so following the story also, I want to talk about Matt Burns. Okay. A former NBA player. And now he has a podcast and he spoke out on behalf of, um, I mean, Yudoki, and he was kind of taking defense for him, but now he's saying this shit is 10 times uglier than anybody ever thought. He said, some things happen that I can't condone. I can't take back. And it's not my place to tell you what happened. If it ends up coming out, it ends up coming out. I'm really going to wait and see exactly what comes out about this. Like I said, this is rich people problems. I get it. I do get it. He has issued an apology. Um, I mean, you dokey, but are we really here for your apology, sir? Put your hand down. You had a very beautiful black woman on your side. I know she can take care of herself because Nia Long has made a great career out of being an actor. So it's like she doesn't even need this money. But, you know, this is this is an example of, you know, black women standing by their strong men and being treated like this. What what, what kind of, what is this? So I think Nia Long will be fine. And again, like I said, she doesn't have to stay with him. She has plenty of options. She's very desirable. But you guys let me know what you think down in the comment section. Do you honestly think he thought about the consequences when he was laying down with that woman? I don't think he cared. I don't think he cared for one moment. 
what happens in the dark always comes to the light. He's a grown ass man. He knows better. But I hope Neil Long definitely gets the closure that she needs to close this chapter and move on with her life. Um, she does not need a scumbag like him representing her. And she doesn't have to represent him if this is how he's going to behave. Okay. But you guys let me know what, what you think down in the comment section. What do you how do you think they're gonna um rectify this situation? Because he has a year to think about it, obviously. He's not gonna be working. Okay. This is going to cost him millions of dollars. So it's definitely going to shift his career and his life. For the betterment, well, it's it's, it's we're going to see. Um, but I do think it's a shame that they have used him as an example um, to cross lines and fire him for, well, not fire him, but suspend him for an entire year when most of the time these guys just pay up, cough up, you know, some millions and they continue on with their career. And everything else gets swept under the rug. They are dragging him pretty hard. I get it. You know, he cheated. But let's just be clear. Other head coaches have done similar things and has only paid millions of dollars and their career continues to uh, to go up. Um, so we'll see. More details will be coming out. Exactly um, what was going on behind the scenes. They said this, this is like way deeper and darker than anybody has ever suspected, but we should wait and see guys. And I'll come back and, um, you know, I'll come back and share my opinion about it as more details come out. And thank you guys for watching the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe.